Why do you keep calling me? Why do all y'all chicks have the same headboard? Why do we all have the same headboard? I feel like I've, I've seen this headboard like 90 times this week. Because this was all the bad bitches guy. You must be talking to a lot of baddies. Hey. 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 <laughs> Flex, I, I saw you on. I saw you on live yesterday, Not you yesterday. Had, or the day before, whenever it was. And your makeup was done, and you was podding, and you was turning up. How, how how is your quarantine going? Um, I've actually been really bored. I've gotten no dick, which is very the main thing that has really been disturbing me. How come girls with titties always keep the phone on just their face? Because y'all need to focus on me. Nigga, if you don't put them tips on the camera. <laughs> I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. Well, I was about to. No, 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 no. Please, 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 please. I'm about please, to drop my OnlyFans link. Not here, you not. This is a gentleman. This is a gentleman live. And no. you, And you too goofy to have OnlyFans anyway. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> you don't think I can do OnlyFans? No, no. Why? No. I would be on there like telling jokes. I I know that's not what it's for, baby. It's for the people with sex appeal. I could be like a bikini top. Telling you don't. Jokes. I'm I'm really not trying to be funny, Lex. You don't you don't have any sex appeal. <laughs> and I think you know that. So I mean, <laughs> wow, that really kind of hurt my feelings. You didn't know that. I thought I was like cute. Well, that's different from sex appeal. That, that's cute appeal. Well, I mean, a lot of people don't have sex appeal. So that's okay. I didn't say it wasn't okay. But on OnlyFans... OnlyFans, I could go in there and tell some knock-knock jokes in my bikini top. The boy's gonna love it. Y'all said bad bitches don't have personality. Mm. Well, you give it a shot. Are you gonna support it? No. No. <laughs> No, I need my chick. I need my chicks a little further along in what to do sexually. <laughs> oh. No. What? I think you like quiet women. I think men like quiet women. So you saying men don't like me then? <laughs> uh, no, I'm not saying that. I'm saying that you got a few more years to go before you hit the peak of your bad bitchness. A few more years to go. I'm already old as fuck. How old are you? I'm 30. Oh, no, babe. You got time. You got time. I don't have no time. No, you got time. You you at the beginning of bad bitchness. This shit like, just started. I'm tired. I can't, being a bad bitch is hard work, and I don't want no parts. Well, how bad are you? You ain't got dick in how many months now? Hey, it ain't been that long. Goddamn. Relax. Oh, sorry. God damn. You All right. Know. I'm sorry. No, you didn't put me on blast ever since we got on this live. I, don't, I hate it here. All right. Fine. I'm sorry. We love you. I exactly. don't want to put you, you on blast. My dog. Subscribe. Well, go ahead and plug your uh, OnlyFans that's coming soon. Go ahead and do it. Give it well, to the people. Well, I don't have an OnlyFans yet, but y'all can go watch uh, my podcast. It's then you go. Me. Plug that shit. No, you need to come on the podcast, actually, so we can talk shit to you. So y'all could talk shit to me. Yeah, because I feel like you need to put it, be put in your place. Tell me more. You know, Joe, I feel like the way you you don't think that baddies have a mind and a business mind. And a lot of times you be, you know, throwing little slugs. You be throwing slugs at the girls. I don't think the girls are so bad. What girls? The girls. So you saying the baddies don't have business minds? No, you said that. <laughs> no, you that's what you be implying a lot. No. That's not true. I think the real baddies have have business mind. Mm -hmm. So what do I need to be put in my place about? I support. I support. I support y'all. Okay, I like how you being on your feminist tip. Yeah, Lex. You know. You know what bothers me? Some of y'all know me in real life. So in real life, I'm a feminist. You know what's crazy, Joe? I really find myself taking up for you a lot, and I fucking hate it. I but, fucking hate it because you know what? I hate to say this, but you're really not bad in real life. <laughs> you're not that bad. You're not that bad. But, you know, I feel like there's a difference between Joe and Joseph. Joseph is really nice. He's sweet. Joe Budden is a character. You know? Okay. I can, I can take that. 
You know what I'm saying? I feel like you're in person. I was actually surprised. I was like, oh, shit, he actually cool. Yeah, I'm cool, Lex. No, you are all right. And, and tell the people how I'm not uh, vagina-based. How I'm not centered and focused on fucking everything moving. I think they need to oh, hear that. What? I think they need to hear it from a girl to believe it. So I will say this: you are not as thirsty as the people think. You be around. A, you have a lot of women friends that you don't hit on. You do. You do. Yeah. But you still, you still, you still a man. You still horny. All niggas be horny. You have your little comments you make. You know what I'm saying? Like the normal guys. But you don't like, you don't hit on women a lot. You really don't. You really be chilling. Thank you, you don't like to be bothered. Thank you. Yeah, don't do you don't misrepresent me. I walk in the club and go to the corner and mind my business. You did when we were in Houston, you sat in the corner the whole time. You and then when the and then when, when when chicks try to throw pussy my way, I stop them so they can love themselves. Right. Wait a, hold on, wait a minute. I must have missed that part. Who was throwing pussy at you, little Joe? In Houston, a bunch of bitches throw pussy at me in Houston. I mean, I believe it. I just want to know who it was. Lex, it has been a pleasure talking to you today. 